Discretion is advised. What's up, y'all? Welcome to a brand new episode of LSPDFR. Today, we're going to be out here as an FIB or FBI agent in Los Santos or San Andreas for the most part, since we don't actually have a jurisdiction. It has actually been quite a while since we've done an FBI patrol. But I figured there was this callout pack that I found called Pragmatic Callouts by Super Pyromaniac. And there was a couple different FIB callouts in there. And I figured today, why don't we just go take a look at them and check them out. That is what we're doing today. I got myself and my partner right here in the shotgun seat. We're both FIB agents today. And we're going to take a look at these callouts and see what the... And see what crime we can stop and whatnot. But the vehicle today we're using is a 2020 FPIU. So the Bureau has upgraded from the Tahoes and Suburbans to the 2020 Ford Explorers. And this one is actually made by Trooper 18. Yes, they ended up going with the hubcaps instead of the original Steelys. But that is to kind of give it a more, you know, civilian look to it. It's a very nice looking 2020 FPIU. I still am not like on board with the look of them for the most part. Like they are still kind of, uh, you know... I like the 16s better than I like the 2020s, but everyone has their own opinions. But honestly, this one does look kind of pretty good in game. Here's a look at the interior, which we've kind of already seen. Uh, not really a finished interior, as you guys can see, there's no dials. But we do have a laptop, a speed radar for an unknown reason. Since we are FIB, but we're just going to roll with it. Then we have like OnStar, and, or not OnStar, but like your radio and stuff like that up there. One nice thing about this vehicle, one stage ELS. So here is the light setup on this vehicle. Looks super nice. I love the light setup on this vehicle. It's super nice. I love the white flashing or the flashing white lights in the in the in the bumper there. It just looks super cool. And then let's look at the light setups in the window. It just looks super nice. But yeah, that is what we're basically going to be taking a look at today. So as you guys can see, we're currently in front of the FIB building and whatnot so yeah that's what we're going to take a look at today i do apologize for not having uploads the last two days been kind of busy but we should have uploads every day now at 10 a.m central standard daylight time for the rest of time for the most part so without further ado let's go ahead and come on out of here i guess those idiots were waiting for us even though they can just you know go around but they just don't want to because they're too lazy but yeah, so we're going to go ahead and come around here, check out these callouts, and see uh, what Los Santos decides to bring our way today. Attention all units, officers report a 242 in Pillbox Hill. Any unit in the central area, we've got... I'm saying 4, I'll be 76. So the chief of Ten FIB four. needs you for two drug dealers. You're now going to meet with the chief at the FIB building. Or meet the chief of the FIB building. So that's where we're going right now. Uh, we'll go ahead and just kind of run code 3. Supposedly they need us for a couple uh, drug dealers uh, from what I can tell. We're getting some really bad frames in this game right Oh my god. We're getting some really bad frames in this game right now. That's what I can see. So hopefully it's not an issue for the rest of the video. But it just looks super choppy and stuff like that. But looks like we're making a left up here. I swear to God, if we end up having to go back to the FIB building, I'm going to be mad because that's exactly where we just came from. That is exactly where we just came from. I'm going to make it right up here, and it looks like we are actually going back to the FIB building. So it's up over here. We were on the bottom, but it looks like we're going to have to go up top now. Woo, dude. I did throw in a new siren into the game. This is the DR Intimidator siren. Alright, so it was proportionality that made the uh, siren. I believe we're supposed to go... Oh, I believe we were supposed to go on the bottom. Okay, so I might end up having to actually go into the IAA building. So that's what we're going to go ahead and do right now. I'm just going to leave the vehicle where it's at for the most part. It should be fine where it's at but it is a nice 2020 FPIU so I have a feeling we're actually supposed to go inside here is what the deal is which I think we yeah we can 
And this guy's the chief right here. What's going on, chief? How's it going, man? Hello, chief. Ah, hello, detective. How are you? I'm good, man. How are you? I'm not a detective. I'm an agent, but thank you very much. I'm good, thank you. You want to speak with me about something? Found two well-known drug dealers, and we need someone who's going to arrest them. All right, we, I could definitely do that. It's the last time dealing drugs here. All right, so they're sending me information. We marked the location for you on the map. Search the yellow circle area on your map. Try to find and arrest the dealers. All right, so I don't know if we're going to give any descriptions of anything or what the deal is. But I've got a yellow circle area right down there. I think they said it was just one. Yeah, so it's down there at the docks and stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and run that way. Uh, they didn't give me, I don't think they're going to give me a description or anything like that. I think we're just going to have to kind of like, you know, circle around and stuff like that. But I'm going to try to get my partner in the vehicle with me. Going to turn the lights on for safety here. There he is. We're running towards us right there. This is a super nice FPIU. I do have to admit, it's a very nice one in, in game. I like this one a lot. There we go. Don't want to wreck the new vehicle right off the bat. I gotta say, this is actually a very nice sounding siren. I found this siren on lcpd4.com and I kind of fell in love with it when I first saw it. Or when I first heard it, basically, so. But we're going to go ahead and head down into the docks, and I'll meet you guys once we get there. Alright, so we are getting close to the docks here. We're getting close to the yellow circle where we're supposed to find these dealers at. Um, we're in an unmarked vehicle, so it'll be a little bit hard to detect. Doesn't look like a Ford Explorer. It's kind of like a um, off-brand Ford Explorer. But it looks like it's going to be in the area over here. I do see a couple individuals back over there. So I'm going to go ahead and park out over here. I do got a pistol. I do got a combat pistol, right? Just a pistol. Okay. I did find a couple different other weapon mods and stuff like that. That I'm going to be throwing in here soon. One thing I do know is that GTA 5 is going to be coming out with a... Uh, with the new update soon so I'm trying to um, update the game as much as I can before that because I know it's gonna break and I'm gonna try to record some videos and stuff like that before even if just in case it does break and my backup doesn't work on the ground on the ground both y'all on the ground both of y'all on the ground What the hell? Why did he have to shoot at her? I don't understand. This bitch is going crazy now. Stop, 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 stop. I don't understand why my partner had to actually shoot at her. Now she's going crazy. What, what the fuck? Stop. Get on the ground, lady. Get on the ground. All right, uh, Agent 241, you sent me a medic to my 20 for one individual. Code 3 would be a uh, first responder medic. Ambulance, assistance required in Elysian Island. Stop, stop, stop. It's like she goes back over there, but I don't know why. Whoa, whoa, hey, 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 stop, stop, stop. Get on the ground. On the ground, both of y'all. I gotta tell you, nothing ever goes right in this game at all. Like ever. I don't. Un I I I. I I don't even know. Get on the ground, both of y'all. Can I even like come up to him and like arrest him? Hey hey, on the ground. What the fuck? That is just a weird pose for her to be in. Like, what in the absolute hell? 
Uh, 241, now can you send me a medic to my 20 for one individual? Or two individuals? I'm gonna grab that money. I'm gonna search the bodies here, see what's going on. I feel like this is gonna be the last time dealing for both of them, because they're both gonna be deceased at this time. So she had a baggie containing white powder, substance, a key ring, and a pack of cigs. And this one... Well, I guess that one's not dead. Ooh, that looks amazing. Look at that yellow Forge 4. That thing looks amazing. Looks like they upgraded too a little bit. That is cool. You're right. Thanks, bud. Thanks. Hope we got here in time. So I can't search this one. Uh oh. Only God Just can a save this, this time, one. okay? On the ground, lady. You fucking idiot. Oh, shit. I'm so confused. This call out is so glitched, like it's not even funny. LXPG, hold it. This call out is so freaking glitched. Get on the ground, lady. Fucking asshole. Mom's right. I should move to Vice City. Can I like arrest her now? So it's not even like showing her as a ped. I'm gonna go see if there's anybody else like around the building here. I do have a feeling that it's these two, but I don't. I feel like this one's deceased. Alright, 241. Send me a corner to my 20. One individual, but it's not even showing dealing showing her as a pet right now. I am so freaking confused right here. This is confusing as hell. Um. Well, we stopped them from doing from drug dealing, and then I guess this is gonna be their last two deals, but. I couldn't arrest them because there's no cause to or no cause to arrest them because she's glitched out. This one's deceased. There's multiple blood splat, multiple blood like puddles. I don't know. We're just gonna end the call out and stuff and. Attention, this is dispatch. We are code four. On the ground. The units required. On the ground. Stop it. On the ground, lady. Get on the ground. Okay, so she's up and going now. I don't know. Let's go and arrest her now that the callout's ended. All right, let's see if I can get a corner for this one. Okay, so yeah, she's nobody. Really? All right, ma'am, at this point in time, you're just being detained right now for my safety while I try to figure out what's going on, okay? Got anything illegal on you? You have some? Anything that's going to poke me or stick me? If your hands wander a little, I won't be mad. Okay, that's good to know. I'm going to pat you down just to make sure, okay? So, I don't really remember if she was the dealer or the buyer. I'm assuming she was the buyer. Okay, so she's Christy. She was the one that's apparently dead, so they must both be named Christy Munoz. Okay, so she's got the white powder substance at this point in time. So we're going to question her about that. What's this uh, suspicious white powder here? It's flour, huh? All right. Come over here with me. I'm going to put you in the back of my squad car. I'm not quite sure why the menus are conflicting again. I thought I fixed it. Now she's on the ground. Okay, this is turning into a weird... There's a clipboard right there that I don't remember seeing before, so that's kind of new. But I'm going to go ahead and put her in the back of my car right now. While we try to figure out what's going on, why she has... Um, Weed on her. 241, can you start me additional uh, patrol unit to my 20? Needed on a 
Signal Street. Put her in the rear of that seat there. Dispatch, Ocean One here. We can take that if no one else wants it. All right, up in the car, ma'am. I thought I said code two, but I guess code three actually works. Get in the car, lady. Two forty one, twenty seven twenty nine. Christy Munoz, three twenty six seventy four. Spend a license. All right. What's going on, officers? I'm just going to use the back of their vehicle for the drug test kit since we technically aren't supposed to have one. So I'm going to do a evidence check, the narcotics field test on it, see what it is. So we're going to test it for, I'm going to test it for cocaine first. I feel like that's what it's going to be. Positive for cocaine, alright. It's got cocaine on there, it was a drug deal. Uh, one's deceased in there. So, uh, yes, yeah, have you guys do your investigation. All right. Appreciate it. All right. So, apparently she's deceased as well because she doesn't want to get in the car. I'm going to go ahead and hop on the computer here. So, Christy Munoz is suspended. We're going to give her an arrest report for possession of the cocaine. Which I think is actually a Schedule 2. I don't remember if she was actually the one that was selling or if she was the one that was buying. Submit those charges. And there we go. But she did have a warrant for domestic violence. But she wasn't driving so I'm not too worried about the suspended license. Let's see if maybe we could take her. Let's see if uh, she'll answer some questions here while she's assigned to be on the ground there. So you know that stuff came back as uh, cocaine, right? Where'd you get the drugs from? Your brother's the Ice King. I've, I mean, I've heard that multiple times that their brother's the Ice King. I don't know how many times, the, how many brothers or sisters the Ice King has, but everyone's been saying that to me. So, where, who do they belong to? Is the question. At this, I mean, yeah, you are going to jail. You were in a drug deal. You're buying, buying or selling from a drug deal, and plus you had drugs on you. So yes, you're going to jail. Plus you assaulted her, so it's possible. Uh, she's actually might even get uh, charges on her because she did commit murder on that one individual. Uh, but it's glitched out, so there's not much I can really do. But yeah, we'll go ahead and charge her for the murder too as well. I know that it, like, it glitched out a little bit, but for the most part, she did murder that individual, so. And it'll be, it's not manslaughter, I think she had pretty much wanted to do it. It'd be aggravated, well, it wouldn't be aggravated murder. It wasn't manslaughter because I don't think she. I think she meant to kill her. So I think we'll do second degree murder. I think I'm not quite sure what the difference is between them. So that's what we'll just get her with. I'm gonna try to like um, brush up on what those are and what the differences are so that I can um, charge them properly. But. I'm going to go ahead and get a transport for her, which is going to be hopefully these guys. Assistance required on, um, signal street. Move away from my door so I could shut it, lady. Okay, and I guess an officer just fell from the sky. Interesting. This is turning into one great episode already. So we have an individual over here that I don't think I can really do anything with for the most part. Yeah, there ain't much I can do with her. Except maybe try to shoot her a little bit, try to kill her, see if you know she'll, uh, call out will end. Alright, well, we did what we had to do to end the call out and end that pursuit and whatnot. So, uh, yeah, what we're gonna do is hop back in the vehicle here. I'm gonna get my partner, 
Or I'm going to dismiss this guy because I actually think that he's my partner. Nope, he's just a nobody. So I'm going to hop back in here. And I'm going to go ahead and tell my partner to come in. And we're going to call this one Code 4. And we're going to go ahead and go out to the next one. And see what other crime we can stop in Los Santos today. I'm not quite sure if all the other callouts are going to glitch like this one did. Um, I feel like I did something wrong by showing up like that. But I don't really know for sure. But... Yeah, for the most part, we're going to go and see if we can stop some more crime out here in Los Santos. Alright, looks like we got a group of criminals that took hostages. Any unit in the central area, we have... Police department called for the hostage rescue team to rescue all hostages. That's something we can do. And we can actually use our new siren for that as well, which is cool. Hopefully these guys, of course, they won't listen at the intersections. That's nothing new. That's been GTA 5 for the longest time. There we go. Clear out those intersections. What? Looks like we're taking a left up here. There we go. Taking a right up here. And then it's just going to be at the uh, racetrack, it looks like. Interesting. I don't know why there would be a hostage situation at the racetrack, but I guess there is. Uh, I don't see it. might not be at the oh come on man it might not be at the racetrack honestly it might be in this build it might be in this um place over here because there is an interior over here that i can go into All right, so we're on scene. I'm going to go ahead and grab my rifle. So apparently my FIB agent's gone. I have this guy as a partner. Oh, shit. This is not going to be good. This is not good at all. So we got everybody out here against us. We got everybody out here against us, it looks like. We got cops. Oh, those aren't cops. That's a biker gang, man. I can't do this in first person. I need units. I need units. Already shooting out the new 2020 Explorers. Oh, this is not a this is not good at all. He just had a major massive shootout. 241. Shots fired. Shots fired. Shots fired. There's one guy over here, I think. He might be dead. I'm gonna go ahead and hop in. Man, they throw our whole bumper off, man. That's crazy. I'm going to go ahead and come over here. Apparently, there's a hostage situation. I don't want to, like, go in and, you know, spook the individual. Looks like there's an individual dead already. Two forty one subject is gonna be suspect and subject's gonna be down at this time. Oh, there's another one. Attention, this is dispatch. We are code four. No further units required. Two forty one, I'm gonna need a couple uh 
ambulances to my 20. Ambulance Make sure there's no one back there. In, uh, East Vinewood. Make sure there's nobody in here. We got a bunch of hostages that are dead right now. This guy is a gunman, so we're going to search his body here. And LSPD4 just crashed. Lovely. Fucking great, man. Alright, I'm going to quickly load it back up, and we'll get back on patrol here. Alright, so we got it loaded back up here. I'm going to go search the bodies here. See what the deal is, what their names are, and all that fun stuff. And we're going to try to say, hopefully save the hostages here. I don't know if we're going to be able to, though. But let's have matches, a bag containing unmarked pills. And then we've got this guy over here as well, which we took out in one fucking shot. Which was a freaking badass as hell. So his name is Claus Bauer. This guy's name is... Uh, Frank DeLucia. And he's got nothing on him. Absolutely nothing. So I want to see, try to get another ambulance in here. Because I don't know if the other one came through. Ambulance. Assistance required in East Vinewood. Because we got all those bodies out front here too that are deceased as well. So yeah, it's been a heck of an episode so far. The whole damn biker gang was out. God, can you guys turn off your fucking sirens? Jesus Christ. Man, that is going to get annoying quick. So we got some weapons that we can run here. But that is going to get annoying really freaking fast. We got a pump shotgun and we got a pistol that we can run. So the pump shotgun's valid. The pistol is valid. Then I also have some narcotics that we can run the bat or the baggie of pills that we found. See whose pills they or pills they are. See if it's possibly PCP. If not, it might be fentanyl. Negative for that. So it's fentanyl. Okay. Medics are on scene. But I wish these cops would turn off their fucking sirens because this is kind of annoying. Man, this was an absolute crazy freaking shootout, if I do say so myself. Alright, so it looks like the EMTs are going to come do the uh, individuals in here first. Which makes sense, since we can't go that way. There's nothing over there. I don't know why they'd be holding these guys hostage, but... I, I, I don't know. I just don't know. I'm just here for the most part. But yeah, so we'll hopefully try to get some of these guys rescued and stuff. But I feel like that is going to go ahead and do it for this episode. I really do hope you guys did enjoy the kind of uh, FB, FIB episode. We are going to do more here soon. Just figure this would be kind of fun to do from the usual patrols and stuff like that. And like I said, since I did find this call-out pack and whatnot, so... I do hope you guys did really enjoy. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys follow me on all the social media, Instagram, Facebook, all that fun stuff. As well as join the Discord server. But we're going to wait here. It doesn't look like anyone has been revived and stuff like that, so... As of yet, I don't think anybody will be revived, unfortunately, but it's going to leave it on a bad note like that. Oh, they saved one guy, it looks like. I tried my best. They saved him. Oh, no, they didn't. 
Almost. Almost. I see the body. But yeah, so. Oh well. Almost at him. Almost. But yeah, that's going to go and do it for this one, guys. Take care.